hoping and praying and singing and praying that you can see me. Do you think you can see me? see me, you know, it's only God's grace, God's grace, can you hear that, tuck, 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 that's the electric fence, when one of these hits the electric fence and it shorts the circuit, anyway, it's an important day, and on the cusp of something that's about to be so incredible, none of us can even understand. But we are sitting here in waiting. The presidential vote, the greatest thing today, actually, what put the smile on my face, what made me happy, is King Charles III of England and Ireland and Scotland and Wales and Jamaica. His first state visit was our state president, and it was just so fascinating watching him climb into, and our commentators called it a Bentley, which it was not, it was a Rolls. And they took him away. And, you know, I'm pretty much a conspiratorial mind. But I know also with the astrological movements that this is the beginning of a shift. I said it last night. It's got not only to do with our personal lives, but internationally as well. And South Africans know it, but they will step aside because, you know, it's like the World Cup football, FIFA, in Qatar. Now, on the day of the beginning of the day, we're not selling Budweiser. Who the fuck cares to drink Budweiser? I have no idea, but that's a different matter completely. And Budweiser tweeted, well, that's awkward. We have no right to go into somebody else's country and to tell him how to live it, especially if they're not South Africa. Because when we, when they came to South Africa, it's like, we're doing like this, like this, like this. We are owned by FIFA. And we agreed. We didn't die, but Qatar disagrees. We will not, they will not flounder. Yet, this morning, the talk show is all about, this is about Qatar, how bad they are. It's like, no, dude. You don't talk badly about Qatar. I'm so sorry. We're watching football. And if you need your draft of Budweiser, of all beers you choose Budweiser, well then enjoy it. Sit by yourself in your... You know, you get these, these rooms that make these... These children feel happy. You know, these happy rooms. Go and sit in your happy room. 
Suck your dummy. The Arabs are very good people. They take care of their people. But you want to preach human rights. My dad set up this sound and lighting in 1988 in Zimbabwe, in Harare, for the human rights concert. Nobody ever cared about human rights. It's about volunteers and the people who control the volunteers. That's why nobody wants to watch CNN. It's not about a warning, it's not about telling you, it's like, oh, you have to do this, you have to do that, no. Because it, if it was going to happen, it was going to happen yesterday. So now how do we control about, now our, oh, it's like, it didn't happen. It didn't fucking happen. Now what? Now we got to live with each other. So what's the point of before it, if it does happen, we kill each other. We tell each other, oh, you must be cancelled before it happens. Make sure before the end of the world happens, you must be cancelled. Who's going to be the grown up here? I know I'm, I was not voted to be the grown-up. I was not raised by a grown-up. <laughs> he, he would rather play in the playpen rather. And not sexually, <laughs> I hope. Who knows? No. No. I watched it. I was the child. I saw it all. It's like I was not given the attention they, and nor were they given the attention. But to be trolled by a policeman in my street this afternoon, this evening, maybe he felt, oh, he must slow down. In his wild track Ranger Ford with like 500 LED lights in the front and the roll bar in your gold and black when are you going to learn these are my streets you can't follow me Or intimidate me. Oh, it will be a grand day tomorrow, I think. And if it's not, that grand day will never happen until I say so. I thank you very much for watching this and I hope you get this video and if you feel sad then just hit that little subscribe button because then you've joined the Lionel train choo choo because it means I object I want that railway straighter please with a nice little tunnel through the snow Arrivederci. If you comment because you know, then just do it. 
under supervision, please. Keep those little tentacles out. But don't let them burn the ones that don't. Don't let your tentacles burn the ones that show you where to shine uh, the light. Okay? It's all about the light. Where are you going to shine your light? Tell me in the comments below if you liked this video or you thought it was freaky. Please share it if you dare to. And remember, I love you lots. I do. I appreciate everything that you do. Almost, I can smell you. I can see you. When I put you in my mind. So please comment. Because I appreciate it. Ciao for now. Talk to you Jupiter staring at me. <laughs>